Well, I'll tell you what, as far as the forecast goes, we really don't have too much to worry about. I think the best news of all is that it's going to be more comfortable in the days to come. Partly cloudy skies will greet you as you get up in the morning. Temperatures right around 60 will be in the 70s for the afternoon. It will be cooler. We still have a chance for some isolated rain, maybe a rumble of thunder or two. We are currently sitting in the low and mid 60s across northeast Ohio with a lovely brisk westerly breeze. That breeze is certainly nice out there. The big change is the dew points. The humidity has been on the decline. We had humidity levels today. The dew points were in the mid 60s. We're now in the mid 50s. That's a huge change. Much drier air pushing in. So tomorrow morning you're going to be off to a nice crisp start to the day. It's going to be one of those days you want to go out and hang out on the porch a little bit. Have your coffee outside. Partly cloudy skies will be around as we get the day going. What's left of the rain showers that we dealt with earlier are now outbound. And you can see these kind of scattered showers going on in portions of Minnesota and Wisconsin. This is uh, instability showers. This is what we will be dealing with tomorrow afternoon. But you can see that between the showers there's a lot of dry space. And we're probably even going to see some peaks of sun. So we'll start with some sunshine. You'll see those cloud towers going up. You'll probably see some rain here or there. And then everything kind of fades away. Here's a look at your national design mark, hour by hour forecast. And as you can see in the morning, we're going to start right around 60 degrees. Partly cloudy skies to get the day going. It'll be a little breezy tomorrow once again. So keep that in mind. Midday temperatures right around 70. And as we see the mercury climbing into the mid 70s for the afternoon, that will spark up those few showers. So isolated, not a watch out. Out. Certainly not looking forward to the heavy rain that we have had periodically over the last 48 hours. But these scattered showers uh, will fade away as we get into tomorrow evening and the overnight once again. And then we're going to kind of do it all over again. Thursday, we have a little bit better chance for uh, some showers to start to move into the forecast, especially later in the day. There's a look at 1 o'clock again. This is Thursday with temperatures climbing back toward the 80 degree mark and the scattered showers around. Here is then is a look at your Universal Windows Direct <laughs> forecast. And you can see how things are kind of stepping back into uh, the summertime direction. Mid 70s tomorrow, upper 70s Thursday with the scattered rain and storm chances. Then we're going to go dry again for Friday if the heat kicks up into the mid and upper 80s. Rain and storms likely for Saturday with mid 80s. We're going to continue to see lingering rain on Sunday. Then things dry out on us again. So now we're kind of getting rain in waves. So you won't have to water any of the garden or the lawn here for a while. But next week as the heat turns up and we dry out, it's going to be watering cans all over again. Russ. All right, Betsy, thanks.